everyone. So recently, my husband gave me a gift certificate to get some kitchen uh, gadgets because there were things that I had wanted, been wanting to upgrade and improve for quite some time. One of those things, well, that was a really weird inhale. One of those things was measuring cups. I probably have four sets of measuring cups, but only one of them is complete over time. You know, the Dollar Tree set I bought 15 years ago, two of them have broken. Um, and the set that I do have that's complete, the numbers have rubbed off of it. So I just have a time with getting the, um, the measuring cups and all of them have four, I think. Maybe one of them originally had five, but they have one fourth, one third, one half, and a full. Except for this black set I have where it has like a one fourth, one half, two thirds, and then it's like at this uh, level. So it's half. Anyway, it doesn't really matter that much. So I knew I wanted new measuring cups, so I wanted to see if there were any that I could buy that were made in the United States first. So I did a quick search on Amazon, and this is what comes up if you search made in USA on Amazon. And for anybody who hasn't used Amazon to look for things made domestically before, um, you need to check because when you search made in USA measuring cups, for example, a lot of the stuff that comes up even at the top is still not made in the United States. You have to do your due diligence, check the title, check the description. Um, some companies will put it in the title very clearly, made in USA. Some companies will put like a little American flag in the picture somewhere, in that main picture, so you know from the get-go that it's made in the United States. But there are still a lot of companies that haven't figured out that people like myself, my friends, we're looking for that specifically if we can and so you don't know that it's made domestically until you actually go into the item description, which can be very time consuming. So anyway, I'm saving you a little bit of time if you're looking for um, measuring cups. So anyway, in this little picture here, this set, this turquoise set is what I ended up buying, but I bought the gray. You know, now looking at it, if I had known that they had, well, it's not it's turquoise, it's a sea glass, whatever, but when I bought mine, I didn't see that color, or I probably would have bought it, but that's fine. I don't necessarily need to have um, a turquoise set of measuring cups. So these are the measuring cups, and I can tell before even using them that these are going to last a long time. I'm sure you can hear that. That is a stronger plastic than any of the measuring cups that I have. I'm trying to think of what this plastic reminds me of. I've got, I have some gadgets and tools, kitchen tools that are made out of a similar plastic, but I can't think right now what those things are. And this one has six different cups. It's got the one, one fourth, one third, one half, two thirds, three fourths, and one. And look at the one, look at that big boy. That's a, I like that it's wider. Um, I don't think any of mine are wider like this. The one that's the, my old Dollar Tree one that only has two out of five left. Those were wider, but those were made poorly. That's why I only have two out of five left. So these are made a lot better and they already have a little thing to hold them on. On, on my wall, I've put a little metal rod like you would use for a curtain. And I have it setting on two hooks that come out, those little scotch things where you pull it. So I've got these two plastic hooks on the wall with the little hook coming out and I've got a metal rod sitting on there. And on the metal rod I have little uh, metal S's that I will hang this on. And it has all of my measuring cups and measuring spoons so that way it's up out of the drawer, it's on the wall and I can easily get to it. But I will say sometimes when I wash dishes, I'm too lazy to actually put them back onto their hook. And so sometimes I just lay them on the, I hook them on there, which you all probably don't care about. Anyway, I'm really excited about these. I like that they're made well. And I like that they have a design without the design going through. Because one of my sets does have where like um, a shape of it goes in, it shows inside. And then when you go to clean it, depending on what you've used it for, it can be really difficult to clean. For example, cleaning peanut butter, especially if it's been there for a minute, out of something with lines inside of it is just a nightmare I'd rather avoid. So I like that these are smooth on the inside. I really like that there are more um, 
because even if you have something like um you know a two-thirds if you've got one with a mark then yeah you know it's one-third but if you are doing a lot of cooking and or baking it's really beneficial to have several options and as well as these are made i think that these are going to let like i shouldn't have to buy anymore period i'm one of those people that when i buy it i want it to last i don't have the money to buy things that are supposed to buy a, last a lifetime i can barely buy the dollar tree stuff but these are made really well and i don't think i'm going to have to buy any more for a long time if at all and these are made by nordic wear is the name of the company and i believe it said yes it's a small family owned company and these have a five-year warranty so that's awesome and they're safe for the top rack and the dishwasher so i'm excited to not only get some really good measuring cups but also to support a family-owned business um, within the United States. And I wanted to share in case anybody else was in the market for measuring cups and was interested in buying measure, measuring cups that were made domestically um, and were made well. And at a decent price, too. On those search results I pulled up, uh, now I'm looking at it. I don't see any other ones that even say made in the USA. I'm sure there are. But like I said, not all companies are good at making it obvious. Even this one in the search picture and title, it doesn't say anything about me made in the USA. You have to go into their page. So anybody from Nordic where if you're watching this in your picture, put a little flag or write made in USA or something because that will help other people like me looking specifically for domestically made to know that these were domestically made. Anyway. Thanks for tuning in and I'll see you next time. Have a good one.